The new measures applicable for the month of September states that adults are required to be vaccinated to access public buildings and most private buildings that members of the public have lawful access to, including learning institutions. The previous order, which has since been revoked, had stated that these requirements were in place for government ministries and government agencies. Now, it has been extended to all public buildings. Public buildings mean any building to which the public has lawful access to and shall include both publicly and privately owned buildings, including all institutions of learning. And this is also said to include places of worship, supermarkets, stores, banks and other commercial places. For unvaccinated people seeking to enter these buildings, an appointment must be made and those people must produce a negative result from a PCR COVID-19 test taken within seven days of the appointment. These PCR tests must be done at a private facility approved by the Ministry of Health and cost at about $20,000. And according to the Minister of Health, Dr. Frank Anthony, these measures have been instituted to ensure public safety against the dreaded coronavirus. It's very clear in the order, in section 17 of the order, um, where there is now a requirement if you're going to access any public space, um, you should be able to show your vaccination card once uh, this, the people there ask for it. So it is one way of um, ensuring that the environments in the in the public are much safer. Dr. Anthony posited too that these measures not only protect those accessing a specific service, but also those employed at the establishments. Because if you have vaccinated people, then the chances are uh, we'll have a much safer environment when we, when we visit those places. And it's not only for the people who are accessing the service, it's also for the people who are working there. Because we have to create a safe environment if we are going to uh, push back against the COVID-19 disease. Meanwhile, in keeping with the new measures, Republic Bank, Guyana, the Guyana Bank of Trade and Industry Limited and the Gifland Mall will require persons to produce their vaccination books or negative COVID-19 PCR tests before they are allowed entry. The Giftland Group in a statement noted that they will adjust these new restrictions effect on Thursday, September 9th. Patrons are advised to walk with their vaccination cards and a valid ID card or license to gain entry at the mall, as this will be a primary requirement by law. Step-by-step -step verification will be done to ensure everyone in the mall adheres to these new rules. And if anyone is in possession or produces false documents, they will be sent to the relevant authorities, the company noted. Both Republic Bank and GBTI announced too that where a person is unvaccinated, an appointment will be necessary. The person must present a negative PCR test taken within seven days of the appointment. Reporting for the newsroom, I am Shakima Day.